21-year-old Ming makes becoming a model sound effortless. I just find an agency, agency find me, actually, and then I start modeling. Quite easy. When Ming represented China in the Elite Model Look Competition, agents were impressed by her leggy look and poised persona. I'm quite tall, like in China, like quite tall girl, so that's why they find me to be a model, and then, okay, I think, like, that's a good job. My parents just like, okay, just do whatever you want to do. That's your life. We caught up with Ming backstage at New York Fashion Week, where she was getting ready to walk in designer Prabal Gurung's fall show. Oh, I'm so excited to like being in this show because like all the dress is like so romantic, but they still got like some strong pieces. I wearing a pants, it's quite uh, a strong one. On the top there's like a half fur jacket, black and white. I'm from Shanghai, so that's like a big city in China. It is a fashion city. I mean, now it's getting better, like more close to here or the like fashion week. It's more professional. Despite Ming's hometown pride, her favorite runway moment happened in Paris. I think that's my first, like, first campaign. That's what we work with Ricardo to see that the Givenchy one. I love that so much. I mean, like, this is my first one, so I'm, like, quite new. And then, oh, my God, you know? The feeling is always changing. Like at first you like be nervous or like scared and then you get used to that, you feel exciting and then you enjoy it. So that's quite cool. The runway pro is fast on her feet, but even the best can get tripped up on the catwalk. Once like at a show and uh, I, I was blocked by something and uh, the, at finale and the, when I go out just like fall down. That, that's so awful. I feel so sorry for that. As for life after the runway, Ming has an open mind. I might stay in this industry, but do something else. I just planning to do the like couple of fashion week, and uh, I don't know yet, but I'm gonna find out what I, I want to do.